In an age when people rely on social networking and text messages to communicate, sometimes the joy of writing and receiving letters in the mail is forgotten. Kim Strzok Scheidegger has been a mail carrier for almost 29 years. I get a lot of enjoyment with my job when I when I uh, bring kids, say like uh, a signed autograph from a packer, you know, and they're just so excited. It's really it's really gratifying for me. The veteran mail carrier has also faced some challenges along the way. It was Christmas Eve and I was delivering mail. It was very cold. And so I'm delivering, it's an all walking route, so I'd been out there all day. And it was later in the afternoon, I was going up to a house and I knew there was a dog there, but usually it was a very friendly dog. Well, they happened to have their, their daughter's dog there. So they open the door and I hand the mail and the dog comes out and I get about two steps and he bites me the first time. And because my legs were so cold, I didn't feel the first time he bit me and the second time he bit me I felt that and then I pulled my leg and so I had a puncture tear and then I lifted my leg up and the little dog was hanging off my pant leg and then he was all done biting and, and barking and he just went right by and walked up and went into the house. So I had to spend uh, some of Christmas Eve in the hospital for stitches. Hostile dogs are a major problem for mail carriers everywhere. But Srochai Legacy says they won't stop him from doing his job. For Inside Your Clark, this is Anis Filza Abdul Samad reporting.